Tony Stewart has been racing for the best part of four decades, a proven winner across the categories, on the dirt, in IndyCar, and in NASCAR. Driver of the number 14 car, 2016 will be Stewart's last Sprint Cup campaign. Right now, we focus on the beginning of his rise through the NASCAR ranks, first with Harry Rainier, and then with current Cup Series champions, Joe Gibbs Racing. It was a great honor to have someone like Joe Gibbs want to hire you. And, you know, I had a great relationship with the Rainier family, and they were ready to move up to the Cup Series before I was. And so that's where Joe Gibbs came into play. You know, I wanted the Rainier family to be able to get back in the Cup Series like they were used to but I just didn't feel like I was ready. And Joe Gibbs gave me the opportunity uh, for two years to race in the NASCAR Bush Grand National Series. And I think I ran eight races the first year and 22 races the second year. And then we made the step into the Cup Series with Joe and racing for him for 10 years uh, was probably one of the, the greatest things I've ever done in my career. Bobby Labonte is, of course, the champion for the 2000 season. To be there and, and see my teammate win the second year that I was there, to watch Bobby Labonte get his championship, and then to come out in 2002 in our fourth year and to be able to win a championship was amazing. Here is the 2002 NASCAR Winston Cup champion, Tony Stewart. Followed up in 2005 with the second championship. So it was, uh, it was a great feeling. 20th career win for Tony Stewart, his fourth. Tony Stewart takes the checker flag at Daytona. Tony Stewart, a winner at Daytona, now wins at New Hampshire. Tony Stewart is the 2005 NASCAR Nextel Cup Series champion. Joe Gibbs is one of those people that no matter what form of racing or what form of professional sports he's in, whether it's NFL football or the drag racing series or NASCAR, he's always been successful. So to, to continue that legacy and, and uh, you know, help bring two championships home is something I'm very, very proud of. I learned a lot from Joe, and I learned a lot of valuable lessons, not only driving the race car, but just how to deal with people. And those are skills that I've learned that now that I'm a, a cup owner, a track owner, a series owner, and own short track teams, a lot of the things that I learned in the time that I was with Joe Gibbs are the, the skills that I use right now.